Whether it's to find out your mob name or what kind of man you should date, everyone is taking online quizzes. Those crazy kids. Ryan Broderick from, from BuzzFeed is here to talk about what people are clicking on and why we can't say BuzzFeed. Um, uh, <laughs> so what's up with this online quiz craze? It, it is a craze. It's exploded in the last couple of months and people just can't stop taking them. I can't stop I'm taking addicted, them. Ryan. I'm addicted, Ryan. totally addicted. You know that I am Mariah Carey in the Which Diva Are You? Oh, I got Nicki Minaj. Did you so, really? Yeah. Wow. Why, why do you think the online quizzes are such a trend? Well, the minute you take when you want to show your friends who you got, and then they all want to take it and show you who they got. So it's like this back and forth that just goes on forever. Uh, but before we continue, are they based on anything? Is there any science? Are there any algorithms? Is there anything to these things? We have a team of very talented quiz masters who are working really? night and day to put Do these we? together. He's just yes. saying that because he writes some of the quizzes. <laughs> That's the reason why. Okay, so we all took a quiz, and then you wanted to walk us through it. Sure, yeah. Okay. If, uh, so if you've never taken a BuzzFeed quiz, they work on any device, but we have one on a tablet here. Okay. Um, so it's called, which click would you end up in if you could go back to high school? Okay. And I made this quiz uh, about a week ago, and it broke 2.5 million views. What? So it did okay. Yeah. <laughs> so you wrote this quiz. Yes. Did you get a dollar per quiz? So you made two and a half million dollars on this? Yeah, just the joy of making just a quiz. So wait, really quick, is there a way that you can cheat? Because I know people who try to take them several times in order to get the result that they want. I feel like if you did cheat, that would ruin a lot of the fun of yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of the nice surprise is the best part. Uh, one other technical question. As an author yes. of one of these quizzes, what's the optimum number of questions you make people answer to not only come up with an answer, but also to keep their interest and to make it fun? It's a good question. Well, it's not the census, so you want to keep it pretty short. <laughs> uh, it's not like a psychological test of any kind. So we keep it between 9 and 12. Okay. okay. I mean, just enough so you're, you start thinking about yourself in a good way. Okay, so go, go through the quiz. Okay, so, the first yeah. one. First one is what are you eating for lunch? Okay. There's a couple different options. So I'm going to choose this uh, this nice sandwich. Yes, that looks like a that looks like a very fancy sandwich, yeah. like from Panera okay. or something. Okay. And then it's what your typical Friday night looks like. And there's a bunch of different options: parties, concerts, or just being alone with your loved ones, or right, being alone right. with your laptop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Why don't you turn it to the screen yourself. so everyone yeah. can see? Yeah, what yeah. You're yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All this kinds is of good. Different. This is good. And I'll choose it for you. So which one do you want? Um, I'm going to do uh, alone with your laptop. Let's see what do we get. Alone okay. with your laptop? Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, so right sad. That's that really it. is, that's depressing, Let's Ryan. See what we get. Oh, jeez. Really? Yeah. yeah. There you go. Okay. Okay, so if we keep going, we've got, we pick a Pixar movie, anything from Monsters, Inc. to Cars to Ratatouille. I'm going to do Up. Okay, was that your favorite movie? It, it, it destroys me every time. Citizens, yeah. Okay. Um, then do you smoke? Ew. I'm obviously <laughs> you. Okay. Uh, so then, uh, what's one thing you know more about than anyone? Uh, whether it's arts and crafts, TV shows, mm -hmm. movies, sports. I'm gonna do TV shows because yep. we're on one. I very, did that one. Yeah. Very meta. <laughs> uh, what what hat looks coolest? Okay, so show the hat choices. They have like a visor, a fedora. They have a beanie, uh, a little a top hat. So which one do you want, Ryan? A uh, trucker hat? It's a beanie because it's cold out. You want the beanie? Yeah, beanie? Okay, over here. Come on, John, really? No, I don't know why. Uh, why won't it do it? it? Oh, there, there you go. go. Okay. Uh, then we've got classic video games. Uh, Zelda, Sonic the Hedgehog, Mortal Kombat, okay. Street Fighter. I'll do Sonic. Oh my gosh, we're getting like all the same answers. This is, this is exciting. <laughs> oh, how would you describe your body type? Okay. I'm going to put... Um, Average. Okay, well, no, you should be nice to yourself. You're above average. You have a thing okay. there for troll? <laughs> yeah. If I, oh, I, I did lanky myself before. Lanky. Um, okay. Where would you shop? Where would you shop? Uh, J. Crew, the Apple Store. I feel like you'd go to the Apple Store. I'd go to the Apple Store. Yeah. Means. Okay. And then uh, you pick uh, a version of the rapper Drake. Okay, show this one because there's many <laughs> different versions. There's the one of him with Tom Ford. There's him as Urkel. Or no, him as Lil Wayne, rather. Yeah. And then, um, you know, there's Emo Drake. There's Drake from the Sprite Hey, commercial. there's a Drake. And then there's an actual Drake. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. so go ahead and pick one. Let's, we have to... let's do the actual Drake. Okay. And then um, when you're checking someone out, what do you look for? Okay. Their hair, their eyes, their clothes. I'll put their, their eyes. Okay. Yes, that's always Liar. safe. And then lastly, pick a condiment. Okay. So uh, sriracha, mustard, ketchup. Well, I like Steve Sharippa's new sauce, but uh, <laughs> let's go. What do you want? Uh, let's do sriracha. Okay, okay go ahead. Go. So we only have a little bit of time left. Ah, you got... Hipsters, once again. Duh. And it gives you an answer just like that? Yep. Well, I me. did the quiz, and I said that I would hang with the hipsters, too, so we would be like buddies. Oh, yeah. No, we'd be, we'd be hanging behind the school. It'd be cool. <laughs> okay, I needed help to take the quiz yesterday. Guess what I got? What'd you get? Student council. Oh, I would be so student sense. council, and it just adds up. 
Oh, you are Because I such... picked ketchup. Hold on, nerd alert, <laughs> nerd alert. All right, well now, what is the most popular quiz that you guys have found? The most popular quiz, hands down, was what state should you live in? It actually broke records for the amount of people on one page Where of our site. Where were you supposed to live? Uh, it told me Ohio. I'm from Ohio, it told me Wisconsin. It's bizarre, yeah. Yeah, and then I also took the Disney princess quiz because like who doesn't want to be a Disney princess? And I got Tiana. Oh, yeah. And the result was actually really on, on spot on. So wait a minute, I just, you, you, you just two and a half million people just took that test and you wrote it how long ago? Uh, about a week ago. That is amazing to me. Wow. Great job, Ryan. Keep on making these quizzes. We have Absolutely. a lot of fun with them. So, Ryan Broderick, as always, so great to have you on the couch. We'll see you again soon. Yeah, and go to BuzzFeed and take a quiz. Yeah, exactly.